I remember the phone call that began with, are you sitting down? Never a popular opening line. As I was sitting down, my heart began to race. And on the other line, the nurse unfolded before me the fact that they had found a large tumor under my arm. The test results were not good. First questions I asked her was, can you please check the social security number and to make sure that this is me? because I could not fathom the possibility that I actually had cancer within my body. I never drank, I w didn't smoke, I ate six small meals a day, didn't eat a lot of sugar, I was a second degree black belt in Taekwondo, worked out six days a week. The possibility never entered my mind that my body was slowly dying. As I reflected on the words that she said, I don't even remember the drive home. I do remember as soon as I came through the door, there was no one in the house, and I threw myself on the floor, kicking and screaming before God. This diagnosis came one week prior to my final divorce court date, after 17 years of marriage. In 15 minutes, my three children, 8, 10, and 12, were going to walk in the door from school. The stress and anxiety was more than I could bear in the moment. As I surrendered everything up to God, this sense of profound peace began to replace the confusion and fragmentation. Breathe in through your nose and release. Hearing the words, you have cancer, offers you an instant opportunity to explore the experience of choice in life. In the next 24 hours, consider the opposites here and choose the higher ground the ability to stress or not to stress, to resist what is, or to accept the opportunity for the isness of life, to become emotionally paralyzed or embrace a journey back to you, to battle or heal through love, to overcome or to be overcome, to learn the power of the present moment or live in the fog of the future, to choose God, life, and love no matter what surrounds you or rise and fall depending on what unfolds around you. Anxiety is simply a signal within your body, giving you the opportunity to identify and adjust your perception of a situation and behave differently. The choice is yours, and your reality depends on your choice.